right, guys. Hey, thanks for joining me. It is Saturday morning. Uh, I need to get this hay field raked because right where I'm driving here, I'm coming up to the end. The corner's right there. So right up here is we're going to get the all-in-one and some corral and other stuff set up for the display to kind of go with cattle and cover cropping and all everything that's happening here in the cornfield. But uh, so we got to get this raked up. It's very dewy. It's wet, uh, which is great for raking. Uh, I got to do my corner here. Not very good. <laughs> so yeah, right here, I'll set up the all-in-one with some sort of little mock-up corral and maybe a mock-up butt box system so the cattle guys can talk about that and we can talk about um, low-stress cattle handling and stuff like that and everything that's going on here with covers and cows for that station but we're, we're probably going to have to wrap this hay uh, it's kind of wet and tough so uh, which is fine I don't mind it's beautiful feed I don't mind wrapping beautiful feed it gets me a lot of extra money come winter time uh, but yeah so that's the goal today is get this raked up and bailed up and wrapped up and then tomorrow start setting up for the show out here so we're cruising along raking, but I think it would help if the rake stayed with the tractor. The pin is still there. It fell down. I take my foot. there. These pins are supposed to have a little tang on them. And there's a little plate that's supposed to, there it is, the plate is still there. That plate got rotated. So there's a, this pin doesn't, this one isn't supposed to have the tang on the top. This one has a plate that sits on top of the pin and the plate's got a cutout for the pin and it just rotated and uh, let the pin bounce out. <laughs> oh well. They're just something that's so pretty after you rake the alfalfa or the grass up. The fields always just look so pretty. It smells nice. They're just something about doing grass hay versus the row crops. I don't know what it is. They're just something nice about being out here. Well, there we go. We got across the field pretty okay. It's tough. It's tough. We have dew on the windows of the car till mid morning. I mean, you look at all the leaves, they stayed on there very good. There's a lot of leaf loss on the standing crop on this cutting. Um, fungicides probably would have been a good thing for this cutting. Anyhow, it's, it's, it's borderline. If a guy used a probiotic, you could probably make it work as dry bales. I'm just going to wrap it just just cause it, it i've had such good luck with wrapping so far on this tough hay we've already had a couple cuttings that some of it got rolled up when it was seemed way too dry and it turned out to be a wonderful product um and so we'll be selling this hay this winter and i think it also 
if like last winter I get a premium for the wrapping because it's a nice wrapped clean bale it's not froze to the ground and a big chunk of the bale coming off kind of deal um, I think we got a good looking product here I like it I like it and so guys on that note uh, I'm gonna head in and get working in the yard get ready get the wrapper hooked up and get the bale spear on the 4640 get the quick hitch back on the 44 blah 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 Alright, so the cows heard movement in the yard, so now they have to beller and scream. I refed and rewatered number six, and uh, the wife is apparently waiting for me. <laughs> We're gonna go start wrapping. Dad is Dad is getting bales hauled in, and Rick is bailing. And I had a mouse in my vents. And I forgot my bale spear. She's starting to get the hang of the wrapper. It's not a complicated machine, it's just kind of a pain in the ass machine. Um, I would like a Kano wrap if they're listening to give me a call because we've got some things to discuss. <laughs> Ah, you son of a bitch. Have goofy bales. I don't know why some of them do that. <sighs> and she'll dump that off. This sure works out slick with dad fetching bales. Her on the wrapper, it saves me from having to run in and out of the cab of the tractor so much. When I'm by myself, you know, you, you set a bale, you jump out, hop on the wrapper, that kind of deal. I gotta drive. Oh, that is nice stuff. Look at you. Look at you. We'll chase these guys away. Gotta chase these guys away. Come on. Come on. 